Oh, wait, 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 I just saw the... I just saw the optional. Hello everyone, it is the Almighty Jeff and this is episode 34 of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Last time we started with the memory end of the line, in which we finally hunted down Pearl at way at Waterloo Station. We discovered that our next target is involved with the Bank of England. We helped Carmax by dealing with an anarchist who had lost his son and prevented him from blowing up the Houses of Parliament with a stolen shipment of nitroglycerine. Then took out our next two Templar targets in the Templar Hunt in the City of London and cleared the collectibles in that area. We're back with Evie this episode, of course, and as we didn't manage to take out our second territory at the end of last episode, we're going to start this episode with that second territory. So I've made my way down here. This is actually the last Mart's location at the moment without having to get this next uh, viewpoint over here, and it's a uh, Child Liberation, so one of the easier ones. And there's not actually a lot of collectibles in this area too, so uh, it worked out pretty well. I've just made my way over to the first chest just to uh, cut down on, on time, I suppose. Okay, don't need to do that. And um, I checked because so I went back to the train uh, just to collect my uh, income. And uh, yes, the other memory that uh, is open at the moment is actually on the train. As I said at the end of the last episode, it's likely we're going to be doing a lot of city takeover today because obviously we're not doing any main memories with Eevee. Because uh, we've got uh, the next one in our progress tracker is for Jacob. Why does they keep shifting me around everywhere? It's very annoying. Um, so we'll do this to bring us up to to catch up with the one that we didn't grab last time with Jacob. Then we'll do our next uh, Darwin memory, of which we've got two left. I've actually got two left of both, uh, Darwin and Max. And then, uh, obviously, we'll be shifting back into TakeOver again. Let's drop down. Hmm. Okay, so those two chests are in the liberation zone itself. Or well, in the factory itself, I should say. Uh, is that how we're doing this? Yes, it is. Not sure there's nothing we can drop down to, but we'll live. Whoop. Oh my god, that's a tall building. Trying to go uh, top to bottom. Might be our best shot. Would a beating make you work faster, love? Hmm. Oh, it went well for you, did it? It's a big building, but they seem to be all spread out. It's a bloody murderer. You're doing it, mate. to the floor where the actual uh, alarm is. Very nice. I'll take that. <laughs> Good work ladies and gents. Good work. And uh, boom. That's a fine, uh, fine slice of London that we got though. And did we get everything? Oh, oh one chest. Damn it. Thought we could have just gone swiftly on from that, but ah oh well. It's only right corner. No problemo. And there you go. 
Look at that. Look how much City of London would take an hour. Oh, mama. I bet there's like no topping activities either. Like, there's only that one race that we did. I thought there'd be tons in this area, but apparently not. Right, let's go ahead over to Cruel Caricature with uh, Mr. Darwin. And unfortunately, we don't have any closer viewpoints, so we're just going to have to go from here. So I'll see you when we get there. All right, here we are. And it looks like we've got a, a bounty around here as well, but we're not dealing with that just yet. Uh, track down the source of anti-Darwin propaganda. We are not apes. If the circumstances were not so grave, I'd compliment the artist on the wonderful caricature. They are fools if they believe they can stop progress by printing leaflets and killing newsboys. We must find out who is behind this propaganda before more innocents are harmed. I should feel Quite much right. like it if you could find and remove these awful things. No problem. Perhaps you can catch one of the bill posters red-handed. I was trying my best, Mr. Darwin. That I shall. Hmm. Oh, there it is. Why could you just do a double assassination, woman? Hmm. Where's the secret of London? Might as well grab it as we come through. Ooh. Well, thank you kindly. Oh, no, you don't. Apes. Can't be apes. It's probably in that uh, giant restricted area, I should have thought. Usually is in these kind of th things. I'm sorry, you started beef. Yeah, no, nope. I found you. Bye bye. Ooh, nasty way to go. Well, it was the same animation as like the uh, wanted posters in the old, in the old games. Uh, where's the chest then? Oh, we're in the strand. Okay. Fair enough. Never mind. Probably again in the restrict. Oh, no, never mind. Oh. Ooh. Excuse me, sir. There you go. It's all yours now. Sorry, sir. We go out of our way to find more posters. Are you kidding me? You. What, do you think you're doing? what do you think you're doing? You know, I probably could have pulled up a lot closer there, but I thought it was those, <laughs> those down at the bottom there. No, what? Ah, oh, dear. I am coming to get you. <laughs> I love his little run. Well, to be fair, it's a very quick one. Oh, bloody hell, people. Come here, little shit. Oh, 
Oh, of course, you just spontaneously disappeared, didn't you? Didn't you? This is awfully dingy, isn't it? You can't honestly thank the other good guys in this situation if you're doing this stuff all, you know, the, the doing it like a dingy sewer. You're not exactly fighting for the world, are you? Get out of town. Oh, wait, 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 I just saw the... I just saw the optional. I legit just saw the optional. Oh boy, alright. <laughs> that was a lucky save, wasn't it? Okay. I'm not sure if we needed all of them. Let's put that there. Pick you up. you here put you up put you here and we'll just shift this one a little along hmm I suppose we'll go for this one hope for the best Superb. If I do say so myself. <laughs> I still can't get over the fact that I'm just like, okay, just gonna blow this up, and then no, wait, wait, then throw it at the wall. <laughs> it's a good job I can't that. Beautiful, beautiful. Right then. Back to the city of London, it seems. Uh, so I'm going to make my way over to this viewpoint, and I'll see when we arrive. Right, so here we are. Might as well grab this fragment while we're here. Very nice. Oh, up, up, up! Oh my giddy ants! That looked like a lot of collectibles around there. Oxford. We're right next to a Templar Runs as well. Very nice. Let's find out what the uh, situation is on the way. We'll just grab these, uh, these two chests. Trouble me. How dare you. Okay, Thomas Plackridge dropped the target's body into a nearby grave. Ooh, it's a bit morbid. But, can't really fail that, can we? But let's uh, have a read of his, his thing. Uh, oh, no, he doesn't actually say. Never mind. Thinking there might, might be some level of irony to it. Like he's a grave digger or something. Anymore. 
You're not allowed in here. I don't care about the fact that you're stabbing my boss. But you are not allowed in here. That didn't work out well for you, did it? Oh, come on, mister. Didn't quite work as I wanted, but sure. There you go. Very nice. No Templars for you. Very nice. Whew. That is a chunk. That is a chunk of London. And you got the chunks of London. Okay, uh, I've got a fair bit of this territory. Let's carry on. I suppose you've not still seen a. Uh, Bloody Nora, yeah. I don't know if it's you've got to have a certain amount of territories left or if it's a certain percentage of territories you've taken over. Because we've obviously done a lot more in the City of London than we've done anywhere else. And yet she's still um, she's in the background thinking, yeah, it's not it's not gonna carry on with this, so surely. No chance. I don't have to deal with this woman. Easy as a pie. Alright, got another super secret chest. One that surely we won't be breaking into. Who knows what earthly possessions people may have left. I'm sorry, dear reader, to break the illusion, but I am a bastard. And I am going to make sure that those goodies are mine. Maybe it's going to be a new schematic. Oh, draw Tinderizer. Alright, that's fine. That's the last lot chest in the city of London. Very nice. Alright, let's go out this way. Uh, that actually looks like it's on the roof, so I should probably go back up. Alrighty, uh, we've still got 10 minutes. It's good. Hopefully, it's enough time to do everything I want. I'm not too sure, because there seems to be quite a lot of collectibles in this territory. I'll try our darndest. It's not like we're, on, we're under pressure. Okay. Up we go. Come on, Evie. You can do it, lass. In you go. Is it on top of the? Uh... Hang on, I don't know actually. Oh yeah, it is. Very nice. In fact, I might as well uh, pop in to drop those off now that we're because it's uh, pretty close to where we are. I think. Yeah, it's only there. So, uh, with a visit. Uh, so, if we go, we just got we just got these three actually. It's not that many. All right, here's our next illumination, illustration, <laughs> illumination. Jesus Christ! Yeah, we've got a press flower down here for our lovely Mr. Green. I'm sure, he will greatly appreciate. Don't mind me. Don't 
won't disturb your uh, your little dance. How lovely. Oh, sorry. And sorry. Grab this chest. And then we're done with this little burrow. We'll head on up to our next thingy me bob. Which is the proper way of uh, defining it. Go on. Come on, Evie. Jesus Christ. You could have done that. But no, it was probably a big jump. I definitely couldn't do it, but... Then again, I'm not a video game character. Or am I? Mm -hmm. Ponder on that, children. What if it's all a simulation? In that case, I want to know what my XP levels are, because I mean, I feel like I'm overdue some uh, some perks. But, ayo. Bottle of beer. Okay. A chest up this way. Some grand level. I can't be bothered with this. I don't want your stupid cargo. I just want the chest. Take it, see if I give a shit. Didn't even see you. Okay, oh boy. Did he crash it? He bloody did as well. Honestly, there's never been someone more asking for me to nick his shipment. But at the same time, I just don't need it. Yeah, yeah, piss off. Not interested. Dry my eyes. Okay. It's like, hey, you shared it with your friends. Literally, no one else plays this game. <laughs> so, you know. At least no one I've got on uh, Steam plays this game. I've got our last uh, press there as well. Excuse me. Leave that gentleman alone. Uh, okay. Let's grab this illustration. Our illumination is the now uh, no called. Got ourselves a new fragmental. Is that on green level? Oh no, it's not. I'm used to them being so high up in the sky. And while we're here. Actually, are there any secrets of London in this area? Uh, there isn't. In fact, have we got the secrets of London? We've got a missing one. Somewhere. Where am I missing one? That's weird. I can't see it. Where am I missing a secret of London? Oh. I'm just blind. It's literally right in front of me. <laughs> Never mind, eh? Well, then I suppose we'll go get that, um... We'll put, go pick up that City of London... Um, Secrets of London. Before we pop down. 
Where's the bloody ball? In the way. That's our last beer battle. Two beer battles? There's only so much Sean jokes that you can have in one episode, surely. There we go. The final secret of London in the city of London. Clearing up a ton today. Uh, on. Going down this way. Alright, there you go. Teasing me. Look at it. It's so close. It's so far away. Alright. How are we actually doing this territory? We've got like, this one chest down there and then uh, scattering up here. So we're going to head back and grab this chest and then we'll uh, head back up. Alright, here's the chest. Okay. Come to Papa or Mama. Fifteen left in the city. And yeah, let's head up and take on uh, our next gang stronghold. Okay, kill leader under Tetsu and burn the heist plans. Uh, brother. Hmm. There's the highest pads, I think. But no, those are just logs. Never mind. Ah, there they are. Whoop. Hey, and there's, there's the other chest. Lovely. Thank you very much. You're gonna burn. You're gonna learn. Beautiful. I do say so myself. Oh dear, okay. Hmm. That was close. There's the last three. Obviously. Oh no, don't. Shoot uh, the messenger at this. I'll shoot the messenger. Alright. Well, other than me having to repeat it, because the police buddy killed the leader. There you go, the Master Assassin's Kukri. That's it, that was a job well done. Oh boy. That's a tasty slice. 
we go. Yeah, even if we did take the time to get the list of the collectibles, we've still got that race to do as well, so. Uh, yep, yeah, there she comes. Bloody Nora. I don't have time to deal with street rats. String them up. Yeah, you get out of here. Not interested. Thank you very much. Bye bye. See you at the gang war. All right, let's go through our progress tracker. So we've got the last two secrets of London in the city. Right, we got more. Oh yeah, we got one in um, Strand as well, didn't we? I forgot. Ten pocket spirits. No. Progress checker. As I see activities, we have done a child liberation. Um, I can't remember what it is. Radcliffe Mill? No. Outreach Manufacturing, surely. A large manufacturing warehouse outreach is safe on the brink of demolition 15 years ago and provided a substantial job opportunities to families in the surrounding area. Advertised as a perfectly lovely place to work, the warehouse employs only children these days. And we did. Uh, obviously, we just did the gang struggle, didn't we? Uh, I think we just did Field Lane, wasn't it? Once home to an infamous black market, often overlooked by the police. Uh, Field Lane now belongs to Bloody Norris, City of London's borough's head gang leader. This borough is one of three controlled by the blighters. I think that was um, what we just did, wasn't it? And Templar Hunt, we did. Thomas Black Group was inducted into the Templar Order after surrounding Temple Church with thousands of the most beautiful roses in London. One wonders if the Order knows he achieved such beauty by enriching the soul with the blood of his victims. Okay, yeah, he was a uh, dodgy fellow, wasn't he? Uh, Darwin, we've done uh, Cruel Caricature. And miscellaneous, of course, we've uh, picked up a ton of collectibles today in the city of London and actually finished a few of them off. Uh, now we're doing this with uh, Jacob, so it's Wikipedia, location, city of London, we've got Temple Church. In the Strand, we've got Covent Garden. And collectibles, bear testing notes, we've got Gun and Sons Scotch Ale. 1868, Edinburgh, Sean's tasting notes. When I think back on all the hardship England has inflicted on our neighbours to the north, all the wars, the oppression, the outlawing of the kilt, I'm fairly sure this beer pays them all back with interest. This isn't a beer, this is a declaration of war in liquid form. This is like being struck about the head with a caber and similar Scottish cliches. I'm going to go have a bit of a lie down and a good long think about my life choices now. And the Mariner Lager. Are you having a laugh? Are you deliberately altering these sense memories so they all come up tasting regularly, vaguely of sturgeon and the dark tears of recently divorced plowmen? Did Rebecca put you up to this? This can't be right. This is the apex of the London beer industry before Belgian conglomerates and lowest common denominator macro brews. I can't actually be this, it can't actually be this dreadful, can it? Well, glad it's you and not me. So we've got Forget Me Not and Snowdrop. Illustrations, we've got a communist club at room near Leicester Square. New Year's dinners at the Queen, Great Queen Street Refuge and going to the morning performance of the pantomime. So there you go, very nice. Let's switch over to Jacob. So we'll go through our weapons. So we've got uh, some new things unlocked. So we've got all these just double checking because they're like slipping in new ones, don't they? Hmm. So we've not got these unlocked yet, but we'll get the Master Ruby Kukri. The elegance of the Master Ray Ruby Kukri is in stark contrast with the brutality of his blade. It does look pretty pretty uh, sexy. What am I? Guns are still maxed on, firearms. Yeah, 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 duh. Mike's telling me that I've, uh, need to still do these. 
Look at the fisticuffing belt. How could a belt possibly aid me and my fisticuffs, you may ask? Sadly, if you have to ask, you will never understand the science of it, Marvel, you philistine. <laughs> Alright. Let's check how we're doing with that. Got all these. Oh yeah, we did actually unlock the crossroad belt, I suppose, as well, didn't we? But at least now we know that we're moving, just moving on up in the order that we're supposed to go. And it fits, we're still uh, we're done with all these, aren't we? Let's go back to Simply Jacob. And colours. That's a no colour, I think. Good to upgrade, we're still done with. Very nice. I think that's everything. Can we craft things? Just the pistol. That's 10,000. But we've got it to spare, I suppose, so let's just craft it. Now, everything we can craft has been crafted, I think. As indeed. Very nice. There you go. Alright, that is where we're going to end it for today. Very good episode. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't manage to completely clear out that last territory, but it was very big. And we've cleared out two territories of itself. It was just, you know, the last couple of remnants and a race that we've got to do. So we'll get that done next time. And of course, we've um, done the Darwin memory as well. So that's very good. Uh, next time, we will be starting off with our first memory in Secret 6 with Jacob. And after we do that, we'll clear up the rest of the stuff in this territory. We'll go and meet with Max again and get the, get the next memory done. And then we've got enough time after that, we'll start working on the last two territories in the uh, city of London. See if I can get with those. For a report, let me take a second to thank my amazing patrons, my five pound patrons, I ever the snake and Ron Hyler. If you links to their channels, as well as my other three pound patrons in the description down below. And I'll screen secrets to my one pound patrons. Thank you so much, everyone. It's truly appreciated and it goes a long way on top of the channel, so we do thank you a lot for that. And if you should become a patron, you can follow the link in the description down below. We don't have to do that because at the end of the day, because enjoy this episode, and if you did, be sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Everything changes. Bye, guys.